hello a big shout out to all my subscribers if you're new to the channel welcome to dr v space today we are going to be talking about a specific body part that poses a lot of problems to a lot of people and that is flabby arms but before we get into that i'm going to ask you a few questions are you one of those who have issues with flabby arms and can't put on sleeveless tops? Are you someone who looks in the mirror and what they see is a saggy arm and they're not comfortable with it? Are you one of those who have lost your self-confidence because of flabby arms? Are you or do you know someone who has flabby arms and is not comfortable in their own body. If you answered yes to any of those questions, this video today is for you. I've got a solution for you. But before I get into the solution, let's talk about what causes flabby arms. What are the causes of flabby arms? I'm gonna talk about just two causes in this video today. I'll talk about genetics, I'm gonna talk about aging and low activity. Let's look at the first, genetics. Depending on genetics and your body structure, some people store more fat in certain areas of their body compared to other areas. The second one, which is aging and low activity, as we age, we lose body mass. And with inactivity, comes the sagging of the skin. That's why you see some people have the flabby arms. I know a lot of people out there would be thinking, hmm, I do exercise. I go out for long walks and I eat clean. Why is it that I still have flabby arms? The reason is simple. Exercise is one of the best ways to tone your body. Unfortunately, not all exercises are the same. You can't expect to go out for a walk and have your body toned. There are exercises that are specific for the toning of the body. This is where I come in today to provide a solution with my five 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 flabby arm tone workout what this workout entails is five exercises to be done within five minutes in a day and you're expected to start seeing results after five days each exercise will be done for 30 seconds and once the first round of all five exercises have been completed, we will do a second round of the exercises, making a total of five minutes. You want to get your arms back? You want to get those toned arms? You want to gain your self-confidence? Join me and let's do these exercises. The first move is a push-up. You want to get into the push-up position with your wrist underneath your shoulders and you want to ensure that your elbow is pointing to the back of the room and when you go down your elbow points to the back of the room you pause for three seconds and then you raise your body for those who are beginners you can go on your knees and do the push-up. Remember to breathe. Remember your elbows are to the back of the room. exercise we will be doing to get our arms well toned is bicep curls.
next exercise we're going back on the floor for tricep dips what you're targeting with the tricep dips is this these are your triceps It's at 90 degrees. Come back up as high as you can and repeat the movement. Remember to breathe in and out. exercise is overhead shoulder press. round of the 555 flabby arm workout what you have to do is five exercises that we just completed we do them for five minutes which means you do two rounds of those exercises within five days you will start seeing the results for those who are overweight we have to burn the fat you to work on your diet. Focus on eating nutrient dense food. Watch your portion size eat in moderation. Stay away from excessive consumption of added sugars such as sugary beverages. Stay away from white flour. All those things that are going to pile on the calories but didn't feed your body with any nutrients. I'm going to add a link to my videos that talk about how you can reduce the intake of sugar. I'm going to link up a video that also talks about the four things that you can do to lose weight and develop six packs. That Those two links will be in the description box. And that was the same for everybody who wants this workout to be effective. You have to watch what you eat. It's all about nutrient-dense food. Additionally, I'm going to encourage all of you to do HIIT exercises. What are HIIT exercises? These are high-intensity interval training exercises. I'm going to encourage everyone to lift weights. Let's build muscle mass. Let's get stronger together. You at home, I hope you found this video interesting, relevant, and something that is gonna help you 
or help somebody else. If you have not subscribed to my channel, please take a moment to hit that red button because I'm gonna be here five days a week bringing up different workout routines to serve you. Remember to warm up before every workout and to stretch at the end of each exercise. Also remember, good posture is very important. I'd rather you do a few reps with good form than to do many reps with bad form. All this is an effort to avoid injuries. Until the next workout, it's your girl, Dr. B. Peace out.